For most of us, we tend to be caught in the ritual of Quran. The ritual of reading the Quran. The goal is to complete the reading. Once, twice. So we get it and we find a spot in the masjid, we read it, we get through it, and we feel we've done it. We've given the Quran its due in Ramadan. But the essence of the Quran, the message, we were not reflecting on. We were just focused on trying to finish it in Ramadan. That was the goal. But the Prophet, may God's peace and blessing be upon him, did not instruct that the Quran must be finished in Ramadan. He didn't instruct it. Yes, when it was completed, he went through it in Ramadan. He recited it before Angel Gabriel two times in the last Ramadan of his life. But he didn't instruct it. Instead, he let Allah's instruction concerning the Quran speak. أَفَلَا يَتَدَبَّرُونَ الْقُرْآنَ أَمْ عَلَىٰ قُلُوبٍ أَقْفَالُهَا Will people not reflect and contemplate the meanings of the Qur'an or are their hearts locked up? Chained, bolted, blocked from what the Qur'an has to offer us. Believe me, brothers and sisters, it is better for us to have only read Surah Al-Baqarah, the second chapter of the Quran, in the whole of Ramadan, reflecting on what Allah is telling us there. Allah is talking to us. The message of the Qur'an is there. It is better to have read only Surah Al-Baqarah and reflected, contemplated, and benefited than to have gone through the whole Qur'an like a parrot, reciting the words and not understanding what the words meant as Allah described those in elsewhere in the Quran as donkeys carrying books on their backs. Himarun yahmilu asfara. So this is the goal from the Quranic reading. The goal is that understanding. So whatever time permits for us to have read and reflected, that is what is required of us. Take away this other ritual. Yes, when everybody else is saying, I completed the Quran, we're not going to be able to say it. And we might feel shy. I didn't feel complete the Quran. But know that it is more important, it is more pleasing to Allah that we have understood than that we have read. The Sahaba themselves said we used to learn the Quran 10 verses at a time. Abdullah ibn Mas'ud related this to us, one of the close companions of the Prophet Wasallam. We used to learn the Quran 10 verses at a time. 
And we would not go on to the next 10 until we understood what Allah was telling us and we tried to practice it because that understanding for it to be real it needs to be transformed into action that is the real understanding when it becomes alive in our deeds so I ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to help us to find the soul of Ramadan, taqwa, and to give us the goal of the Quran, understanding, and to make this month a month of reflection and change, a month of purification and guidance, a month of love, love of Allah and of our families, our friends, our communities and a month on which we bring ourselves back on to the straight path 